bought some stuff. Uh, first thing is this. I think it's called Jalabia in Arabic, but it's basically uh, a kaftan. Oh, it kind of stinks. It's a kaftan type thing that you can wear at home. I'm going to wash this and then use it, but yeah, it's a kaftan for the house. You can wear it anywhere. Next thing I bought is this really cute purse. It's actually very unique. Um, I don't think I have anything like this. I'm gonna show you. So those are the two items that I bought today. This is not an angle I expected to film in, but it is what it is. So first things first, I'm gonna show you how I segregate my laundry. You're not gonna throw everything in the washing machine and hope and pray for the best. That's not the best way to do stuff. I have learned a lot from TikTok. Um, so I'm just applying it now um, for my clothes and it seems to be working. So I will share what I use. This is, I use powder. I don't use liquid detergent. Um, I just find that this suds up more. Um, so I use this. This is from Ariel. Okay. Ariel Automatic, that's it. I just buy like the random <laughs> ones. Um, I've been sticking to Ariel for a while, so I just use this. Fabric conditioner, I use Comfort. I love the Gardenia scent, Elegant Gardenia scent. That one is like much more subtle, but this one lasts much, much longer. It's more floral. Um, it is expensive. <laughs> but it lasts a long time highly recommend getting this especially if you have a washing machine like make the most out of your washing machine and buy one of these this really does make a difference for stain removal i use vanish now i don't know if there's a major difference between the white and the pink one i think both of them work the same way i have tried it on both white as well as colored clothes i'm going to show you how i use it as well First things first, you always want to sort out the light and the dark ones. So these all would be under the light category. And the reason being, um, firstly, obviously, you don't want to get stains on this one. I have stained a white bedsheet before, which is now pink. Um, but it's not just about staining, but your darker clothes tend to, um, you know, get... Uh, stick on to lint more and it's more visible it looks dirty if you mix it with clothes that are lighter or have lighter fluff just as an example this one i accidentally washed it in the previous wash uh with white clothes i don't know if you can see there's like tiny bits of lint all over this um the only way to avoid this is to um not mix it especially not mix it with towels Towels and underwear should definitely be the highest setting. I'm going to show you guys the settings as well. But I wash towels and underwear separately um, because it's a different setting altogether. So it, it takes more time. If you have like lace underwear or like very delicate clothes, use something like this so that it doesn't get caught up in the rubble of the washing machine. Also, if you have delicate clothing like embroidery and like very lacy lots of work stuff i would personally just not even put it in the washing machine especially if it's like indian clothing don't put it in the washing machine just give it to the dry cleaners if the dry cleaners is too expensive and it's not something that you can access i would just wash it by hand don't put it in the washing machine it will ruin your dress when you have bras like make sure you're hooking the bras up um, on the ends because the hooks if you leave them loose and throw them in the machine they can get caught up in the drum so don't uh, don't put them loose I have never had an issue with them loose but I don't want to take any risks so I just always pin them like this and then put it in the machine okay guys this is my washing machine this is the candy smart pro simplify washing machines basically this connects to wi-fi as well but i never use the wi-fi setting but anyways this is the setting i use so this is the daily 49 um this is basically how fast it would go and this is the heat um these two would be like the ideal heat situations for you so if you have a customizable washing machine you can rank this up as well okay this um let me just tell you so the first one that says one you can see here there's one this is the pre-wash so this is what your washing machine will initially use 
to sort of do a normal cleanse this is where your comfort or your you know fabric conditioner would go the middle one the one with the flower and then this is your remaining like detergent so i put a little bit of detergent here um and this liquid is the vanish so i use about just a bottle cap amount of vanish here um i only use it for my underwear and towel section um or if something has stained i'll treat the stain way in the pre-wash section um and then more detergent on this side so you can see here i have more detergent than this side and then this is a little bit of fabric conditioner i use very little for the underwear part of my laundry It's not even a good size. I went to this place called Black Tap. Thank you. 